Hello and welcome back to another episode of Phoenix Point. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough of Legendary Difficulty. This is a huge cluster and everything is happening at the same time. We have so many storyline missions, but I do have a plan of actually taking them down. Realign the four teams, put in the work, get the logistics done and then we're going to rock the boat uh, we i've now figured out the classes sort of ish and they are um, having a balanced team as always is something that i really appreciate but we can come to that in a little bit a later discussion at the moment we need to rescue more soldiers um, who apparently are eaten by pen uh, by the pandorans so naturally, uh, this team here is keen of going in and uh, looking out for these monsters. So we got everybody well suited up. That grenade might not be the best uh, one. We've given it to you a long time ago. That's actually not really, really good. That grenade would be better and the fire grenade would be absolutely aw awesome. But we don't have that at the moment. It is what it is. Uh, these weapons, I don't know. I think given that we do have the option to actually go for laser weapons, might as well take that. He doesn't have proper armor. Still rocking that old stuff. If we fight, we need to have enough room, so that's good. Uh, we need to have enough ammunition. We're not on a uh, come in and scratch mission. And double tap Russell is just doing fine, I would think. Sniper rifle, Phoenix sniper rifle. Yeah, yes, the right right rifle already. And Paulie has the VDM Defender, which is fine. The only thing that is not good is his strength. So Paulie is still one over. And I can't change that unless I'm giving up points uh, from the phoenix pool and i'm not willing to do that they are reserved for the prime team because my logic as so often these games is have one prime team and make sure that they can beat all of the content then you're gucci okay so landed we got to get soldiers out of these ruins but we're pretty much surrounded which begs the question here goes. Where are the soldiers? Getting a bit of a better overview. In CVNC, runs up but doesn't find anyone. Okay, a triton there. Fair enough. But nothing else. Well, here seems to be an outlook post that we're going to use next time. Let's go. Here. Ready. Here comes the Phoenix. Can't wait. Wound to here. like to overwatch as much as we can let's show them what we can do look so far we're under the radar uh, but that is okay I don't even know where the enemies uh, where our potential targets are Ooh. 
So got a heavy and an assault. Ready to rumble. And another heavy. Or even three heavies. Hmm. mission went from a no problemo to two mind uh, controlling entities plus the siren in just one go and a triton just on top luckily at least that that guy is missing. There's another mind flare. But as far as I can tell, the enemies are giving our extractionists an equally hard time. Ready to fire. Good, a couple Open of things. Let's start here. Eyes peeled. Oh! We can hit these guys and kill them, that would be awesome. JP unfortunately can't do that right away. Identifying target. Mindfragger is definitely need to die. 30 bleeding means he will be down for good. Well now can't wait. Move to here, shotgun, and it's literally shotgun to the face, yeah. which disables the head. Okay. Well, at least that worked out well. So no Preparing to fire. stupid con uh, mind control. Let's make her also a little bit slower by damaging the tail. And we are almost down to critical levels where she's going to it safe. die. Um. I'm going. All right, bit of overwatch. I think we're fine. We don't need the shout yet. Moving to position. Might be a kill, which would be great. Okay, cool. If heavies hit, they hit heavy. Think about that. Ready. 
Okay, done. Got two overwatches. I'm not picking up a lot of uh, activities from our extraction targets. It seems that they are just getting overrun. I don't know how to push in there fast enough. I mean, we've already killed like what six, six um, alien entities. <laughs> yeah, that guy is dead. I don't think. Yeah. Okay. It's a lot of poison. I think we're pretty much done. I just we can't just leave here. We already know one is dead. One has just been double poison spit. Which kind of tells us there is maybe one enemy, uh, maybe one well, operative in there. Can do. Moving to coordinates. Already there. We're not evacuating yet, but. Mentally, I'm really close to Taking doing aim. that. Identifying Try target. again. <clears throat> Ready to fire. Hostile wound. Yeah, we could jump out, which is the only thing that I care about for now. The option to get out if needed. These guys are hasted, which tells me there is another siren, the one that can haste. Perfect timing, uh, ready. because we just killed her friend, right? Engaging. Unfortunately, can't really hit. Holding position. Eyes. Moves up, takes a couple of shots, and moves back because. I want to be able to leave next turn if needed. I'll try to stop them. Okay, there is a mind controlled heavy. So if we can un-mind control him by killing the siren that controlled him, then there is a small chance that we can get one out of three soldiers out of here. But that requires the siren to show up and us being able to kill all of these freaks before that happens. And with the poisonous worms, it just has become more difficult.
Yeah, we're not even seeing anyone at this point. Question is, do I really want to go another round? Or are we just calling it quits and saying this was a failed mission? We can evacuate every single one. Let's roll. And I'm in favor of doing that. My problem is Moving in. wasting a lot of resources for what? One heavy? That's 200 food. Okay, yes, equipment. I got you. Not bad. But it's still not worth the amount of pain that we're going uh, through. It's actually quite risky. The moment that the siren would con uh, control one of our guys, that would mean we're even further hooked and couldn't really escape. So we had six enemies there at the point when we were um, extracting. That's already a good indication that our firepower was not on par with what was expected. Fail fast, fail cheap, as they say. We're moving on. Got a little bit of that and a little bit of that. Um, over here. Let's find us the investigation. New Jericho doesn't like that. Okay, cool. And this is the exploration side mission that we were talking about earlier. Since it's early in the episode, might as well do kind of a double mission. Double whammy for you guys. So no one has leveled up. Let's deploy the squad. Good, landed. We are up against the bandits. A couple of heavies left and right. Let's build up our defense here. Say hello to my little friend. We'll put a turret there. down and yes. hide out. somehow get to that high ground I wonder here running sniper here. moves up Ready. goes to the high ground running other sniper hides behind a nice little concrete block Salt moves up. Just overwatches. They're not getting past me. Dashing ahead. And our infiltrator is going to take that side here. What are we going to do with the heavy? I think we're better off over here. We can still jump, but there might be a lot coming through here and our shout would keep them busy. Action! 
target nest. Okay, well that sniper just ran into us like there is no tomorrow. The amount of snipers that they do have is irritating. Not good for us. We don't want to deal with that many and they definitely outnumber us potentially two to one. Um, active control of our turret. Let's start here. Ugh. Very nice. I think we're continuing to control the turret. What's our move? Aiming. Good. Let's try to get the guy in the open down first. So many more enemies. Yeah, no, we don't. No, 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 I don't want that. I think we'll take full cover and like fight around that flank can't afford to t let that flank be taken ready to engage yeah we'll we'll get the sniper first target hit Good, that's two kills. I'll keep my eyes and we have up. a rock solid position here. very far away identifying target heavy assault heavy heavy assault sniper we're going to go for the sniper here oh. taking aim now getting the fire Good, if the sniper uses their med kits, that means less problems for us. Born again anarchist. There is yet another sniper, we need to get this guy down. Now, by the way, a melee character would be absolutely garbage because, boy oh boy, would we run into a lot of overwatches.
Continuing the remote control. That guy has a disabled torso. Okay, cool. Well. Trying to get that sniper. Three shots unfortunately all fail. We put a decoy, uh, decoy out. Lining up a shot. something there Here I am let's do this Move Ready forward to ah! I'm on the move Moving back Okay, so far so good. Engaging. Time to try to take out the enemy sniper. The moment that we do have sniper superiority. We can play the ranged game. I'm not feeling it. <gasps> what was that? Aiming. <laughs> Very nice. Ready to engage. Missed. More Overwatch. I think we're out of actions, unfortunately. <gasps> but killed a sniper, injured that heavy quite well, and kept another sniper busy. Perfect. If the Cypress are using medkits, we're good. That's how you do it. Ready, willing, and able. Can't wait. Here comes the Phoenix. Good. Time to finish this guy. I'm prepared. Move up. Oh, that's good. Multiple targets that we can hit. <coughs> and. We very much uh, started getting the armor down. Oh. Trying to get that sniper.
JP cannot control the turret anymore. Not now, please. But that's semi okay because we've dealt a lot of damage. Good, if his arm is disabled, the only thing that he can do is throw grenades. I've often been on the receiving end of uh, this, these unfortunate circumstances where you just lost an arm and you can't do anything. Thinking that could have gone better. Three shots, three misses. There's still one sniper. Preparing to fire. Good, I still want to kill him. Don't want to take any risks here. Still on target. I'll keep my eyes open. Okay, so far everything seems to work out very well. Born again, not our kids. You're gonna get it now. My turn. Action. Damn it, they can throw quite far. Oh shit. Can't hit anyone, damn it. Yeah, oh, uh, our snipers could hit a bit better. I would agree with that. Oh, oh finally we hit something. We're still hidden because we haven't moved a lot. Moving now. Acquiring targets. Good. The moment that that guy moves in, he's going to be toast. I want to use the turret, so we're just recovering for now. Ready to engage. Target here. Gotcha. Ow. Holding position. Good. Decent turn. Interesting, we just hit his rifle. His rifle literally saved his life. His bullets were flying into it. Here we go. Huh? 
What was that? That's an assault. That's another assault. Let's just focus on the assaults for now. Disabling the legs. We're hitting relatively well. Sniper moves into a different spot. Providing medical attention. Ammunition? Are you kidding me? We have no ammo for the turret? Receiving loud and clear. Ready to fire. <coughs> One less to worry about. And we have no more ammunition for our heavy. Well, great. I wasn't expecting this to be an all-nighter. Like the wind. Moving here. Identifying target. Ready to fire. Now reloaded? No. Okay, I need to try that next turn. For now, we'll just overwatch ourselves. Fantastic. Uh, we don't have enough will points. Uh, I was hoping we uh, we could actually reload. That was potentially not the case. Eyes peeled. Okay, so that's one option. Both legs are disabled. 
they should not be able to do anything. Here we go. I'm on my way. At maximum will points, okay. Making well, I tell you what, if that's the case. War cry and make sure that no one is doing much. Here is a great decoy that they can uh, use as target practice. Waste of ammo. Peel. I've got this. Ah! Perfect ah! shot. Good. That resolves the problem. We can still war cry once more. moves into a good position. Takes the kill and gets more willpower. That's good. With two more. On the double. Okay, uh, so okay, let's move up. Got snipe a uh, sniper here. Might as well put that in. And although we're not proficient with it, there's always the chance to do that lucky hit. And finally, Sniper Overwatch. Done. Action. In the meantime, we got two Sniper Magazines here. She isn't really helping position. us. Let's show them what we can do.
moves up. Uh, let's see. One, two. Three. I'm ready. I should have moved out and not just stood there. But okay, it is what it is. We got six will points, so now is the time to wreak havoc. Disabled the arm, and that means no more shots with the heavy gun. Have to focus. Hit the other guy into the torso. I just need the right angle. up these guys have a lot of armor everywhere but it doesn't help them Get this over with. I think I should have some damage. Playing it safe. I'll be there. Good. Time to move closer. Dashing to the coordinates. Just one, one more person standing. It smells like trouble. ran out of ammunition and that means it was a long but meaningful mission we that was another storyline mission by the way should have come here potentially much earlier the enemies were much much uh, lower level compared to what uh, we fought before and they were quite well armored I've now understood the uh, bandits are trying to like solve the problem with armor, but that's not the right uh, way. This is a very alpha strike uh, driven game. Disciples of Anu are supportive of Phoenix Project. Location of Disciples of Anu have been added to Geoscape. Defend them to earn reputation. Failure. Uh, you have done well. The Exalted sends her thanks. And the Synod of Yearning will speak the names of your operatives at morning prayer. Do not feel ashamed of having killed your fellow humans, although you may pity them, for in clinging to the old, they doom the future. The voiceless Hierophant shall judge you when the time is right. That was a great mission. Our diplomacy immediately has gone to supportive. Maybe it is possible, well, 
and he dropped down to only friendly. Maybe it is possible to get every uh, faction to supportive. But we will find that out uh, the next time. Uh, for now, I need to say thank, thank you and have a great rest of your day. And if you are supportive, just as the disciples of Anu, tentacle your way over and uh, squid the like button. That would mean a lot for the channel. Thanks a lot and have a good one. Bye bye.